on the new Talk Radio 1450 WCTC, the voice of Central Jersey. From politics to entertainment, from social issues to lifestyles, from newsmakers to pop culture, if it's Jersey, it's on Jersey Central with Burt Barron, 732-545-9282, or toll free at 888-545-9282. It is 737. We're back on Jersey Central on the new Talk Radio 1450 WCTC, the voice of Central Jersey. It is Burt Barron. Good to have you here. Got the contest for the Bobby Bandiera tickets and also the VIP tickets for this week's conversation with the Clarks. We're going to give those away coming up a little bit later on. But I have a very special in-studio guest who is with us here until 8 o'clock. And if you are watching on our webcam at WCTCAM.com, yeah, you see we have a special guest. She waves to the camera. Uh, There's a New Jersey artist who is keeping a, a very specific art form alive, and she's doing great work. And in fact, the work that she has been doing, they're celebrating their one-year anniversary show, which is coming up to Donnellan this week. Uh, so the uh, group is called the Noir Follies, and it is a Jersey burlesque uh, show. And with me here is Vivi Noir. Hi. Wow. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. It is great to see you. It is great to see you as well. What a wonderful look you have. Oh, well, thank you. Very uh, sophisticated. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Wow. <laughs> so what made you want to get involved in the – when I think about burlesque, I think about, you know, the 20s, the 30s, the 40s. This is the 2016 version of what burlesque is, right? Um, yeah, we, we definitely try to embody the 1920s to 1940s time frame okay. so that we keep it vintage and as authentic as we possibly can, but still tap into modern day culture and modern day forms of entertainment. Young girl like you, what drew you to this, to this uh, kind of classic art form? Complete accident. Yeah. Yes, a complete accident. I started off as a ballerina for a lot of years, mm-hmm. and then through injury and just change of company as I went into contemporary dance, then I got into cruise ships, and then I accidentally fell into cabaret art, which when I was doing all of that, I was introduced into the world of burlesque because they go pretty hand in hand. Sure, sure. A lot of showgirls, and then you have your bump and grinders and your strip teasers, and it becomes a big old family, and it was one of those, let's give it a try, and I did it. I fell in love with it. I've been doing it ever since. I've been doing it for about four years now. Wow, good for you. I love every second of it. i and it's an art form that I can keep going as long as I want to be on stage. There's no cutoff for your age, your your type of dancing, your style. And then there's so many avenues to go outside of it. It's just a humongous world in mm-hmm. its own. It's very unique. It's not a lot of people that are doing it nowadays, right? Um, it's a very, very underground culture. Okay. Um, when you actually tap into it you're surprised how much you find it around but it's one of those things that needs to be brought to your attention and once you see a show next thing you know you're seeing shows all over the place and it really does gets a little infectious and exciting i'm sure i'm sure (laughs) now i've been following you on facebook like anybody can that's a vivi noir yeah Uh, v-i-v-i-n-o-i-r is your name that's how you spell that you can follow anybody can follow you on facebook you do shows twitter yeah, <laughs> you do it. shows all over the place, and you have a, a troupe of people that you work with, right? It's it's kind of uh-huh. like a traveling show. Yeah, um, I work independently as a freelance artist, which is one of the best ways to get booked for work because there's so many producers and there's so many shows out there that you can tap into any any family and perform. Uh, my troupe is specifically showgirls. Okay. The ballerina in me missed the group work and the dan- the heavy dancing, so I have a group of seven, uh, six girls and one boy. I met the boy. Yes, yes, you did. In Red you Bank did. about a month uh-huh. ago. Yes, he is our designated vaudevillian. There's always one, right? Oh, he is. He's our funny man. <laughs> he keeps them on track. And I missed the choreography concept, and I missed the the showgirl aspect of things. So I created them as, instead of having a host interlude, switching the guest artist and the feature artist, I have showgirls. So instead of listening to somebody talk for a little while, you see a bunch of pretty girls bumping and grinding, and what can be more fun than that? Well, (laughs) it's all done very tastefully and in a very sort of retro style also. Absolutely, absolutely. They, it, 
it's very similar to what you would see on a cruise ship on a smaller scale, so okay. we can fit the stage. I mean, so anybody can go to YouTube and look up burlesque and get a feel for what the shows are and you know, kind of the performances and what they can expect at one of your shows, right? Yeah, absolutely. You can also Google Vivi Noir, and sure. there will be tons of videos. Which and... I have done, by the way. Oh, good. I of course hope I have. Stuff. Of course. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> Vivi Noir is with us here this morning, and uh, the, the uh, Noir Follies one-year anniversary show coming up this week. Yes, very exciting. It's a very big deal for us. We've been a family for a full year, and these girls are with me every single Sunday at rehearsal. They are the hardest workers, and my my gentleman is the hardest working gentleman as well. They are branching out even further. We're exploring our artistic nature into sideshow and circus arts and vaudeville arts and it's just taken on a, a life of its own that I had no idea it was going to go into. Wow. Well, that's cool. Well, good. And uh, a year uh, behind you already. So that's yeah. terrific. A one-year anniversary. One so, year. Uh, Roxy and Dukes in Dunellen. Talk about the, the venue. Roxy and Dukes is an incredible rockabilly venue. It is a, it's a roadhouse, mm-hmm. and it's a gorgeous, very homey feel. The staff is incredible. The owner is in with you and hanging out, and it's a very, very... It's kind of like Cheers. Everybody knows your name there. It's a, <laughs> <laughs> okay. it's a very fun place. It's our home base. When I had the idea for the show, he was the first person I went to. I said to I said to the owner Jim, Jim, I have an idea for this show. What do you think? And he instantly knew what I was talking about wow. and was a hundred percent on board and. We've been, I'd like to think we're making magic ever since. Good for you. Hey, that's great. Uh, how does somebody get tickets? Uh, can you buy them in advance or get them at the door that night? What's the best you way? You most certainly can inv- buy them both in okay. advance and at the door. If you buy them in advance, it's a discounted rate. You okay. can go to Roxy and Dukes, Roxy A N D Dukes dot com. Okay. And if you look in the events, they will send you to a page where you can buy tickets, which is exciting because the one year anniversary, we have dropped our ticket rates so that everybody can afford to come. Awesome. And if you buy your tickets in advance, they're only ten dollars. Who comes to these shows? Talk about uh, a typical cross section of uh, of your audience. Is it uh, oh, people's my... grandfather? Is it millennials? Is it thirty or forty somethings? Who comes to this? I have every I have every age. I have every gender. I have it. It appeals to everybody. I've had twenty one year olds walk in the door thinking that they were going to get a a hoochie gucci show, and they're they're completely turned into. Oh, this is amazing. I love the vintage aspect to it. It was so entertaining. And then I have 80-year-old clients that come in and they love the show and it brings them back to their time and they I've heard so many stories about old showgirls that this brought them back to their youth. Uh, the amount of magicians assistants I have met at Roxy and Dukes mm-hmm. is it blows my mind and it's so exciting and it's very exciting for the older crowd too. Um, our main crowd is between 30 to 50 years old. That's our uh, regulars. Okay. So that's a it's a pretty big age range, but we appeal to all ages. We really try and cater towards couples because it's an incredible date night. Okay. You're going out, you're getting dinner. Roxy and Dukes also has phenomenal food. So you can get food, you can get drinks, you get a show. There's always there's everything from music to dancers. Uh, sometimes we have sideshow performers. Uh, this New Year's we're going to, or uh, I'm sorry, one year anniversary. Um, I'll be doing aerial dance. So wow. it's it's everything included in, and it's it's a very um it's a very full night. You're getting a lot of bang for your buck. Sounds like a lot of fun. And it's not a, it's not a nude show. This ain't Club 35 we're talking about. This oh, is no, no, a no. legitimate uh, burlesque performance, oh, right? Oh, yes it is. Right, this right. is the the lowest we go is tassel tricks yeah. and that's just exciting to watch cuz it's mesmerizing. I'm sure it is. Um we only have two strip teasers in the show, okay. which again a strip teaser is a tease. Yes. It is not a it is not a full nude review. Nothing blatant, right, exactly. Exactly. We want you to come back and try and see more. All right. Well, if you would like to see Burlesque again or maybe for the first time, uh, coming up in a little bit, we're going to give away some pairs of tickets. To the one-year anniversary show. Uh, yes. Vivi was kind enough to make a couple pairs of tickets available to us, and we're going to give those away coming up in just a few moments. And if you have a question for her, she does some classes too. We're going to talk about that uh, in the next segment, but our number is 732-545-9282.
or 888-545-9282. All right, more coming up with VV Noir in just a moment. Jersey Central traffic and weather time, 747 traffic and weather every 10 minutes and right to Bernie Vider. Good morning, Bert. Along 22 eastbound, you got the delays by 287 and Chimney Rock Road. Still pretty good on 78 both directions. You will be heavy on Route 9 North, Pride Road to 35 and south on Texas Road into Bridge Road. Also both directions of Route 1 slow. On the northbound side, expect delays over by Old Post Road and southbound slows Finnegan's Lane. Then again to the county line. 130 northbound into Dean's Road. Hall Road is pretty jammed up and along Route 18 northbound. That's going to be slow Tice's Lane into Route 1. Garden State Parkway, if you're on the northbound side, a little slow up to 136. Southbound's actually pretty good. And 287, not seeing anything major. Those of you that normally head for New Jersey Transit, they're currently running on or close to schedule. For more, check out the Central Jersey traffic map at WCTCAM.com. I'm Bernie Vider with the 14th. 50 WCTC traffic update. And a good morning. I'm meteorologist Frank Lombardo in the Weather Center. A pretty good start out there this morning. There are some clouds that'll be moving in probably within the next hour or two. And by midday, we could see a passing sprinkle. Otherwise, a partly sunny day. Temperatures mild, 55 to 60 today and breezy this afternoon. And then tonight going down to near 40 by morning as skies clear. Lots of sunshine Tuesday. Back around or just above 50. Clouding up tomorrow night. Some showers around late tomorrow night and Wednesday. Wednesday's high around 55, but turning cooler late in the afternoon. 48 right now. Still got sunshine. I'm meteorologist Frank Lombardo. You're busy. You're under stress. After all, life happens. The Forest Gate Country Club Life Happens program is your getaway to a happy place filled with fun, friends, and festive dining and events. While the kids enjoy an array of activities in the kids' club, you can chill out. No time to cook and clean up? They've got fine and casual dining options guaranteed to please all palates. Can't get away from business? Work remotely at the gate while squeezing in a workout, massage, or golf on one of two 18-hole championship courses, including the Banks course, rated top 20 by Golf Digest. Join the new Forest Gate Country Club now and receive a Life Happens gift package that includes a night out at the club, three fitness sessions, a golf clinic, and when you join by March 15th, they'll give you a complimentary Fitbit to monitor every step of your new healthy lifestyle. Forest Gate Country Club is the number one family club in New Jersey, just off Turnpike Exit 8A in Monroe Township, easily accessible from your area. If time is passing you by, call 732-521-0070, stop by, or visit ForsgateCC.com and put the fun back in your life. This spring, Experience the wonder and excitement of traditional performing arts from China, Japan, and Tibet at the theater at RVCC. First, astonishing athletes defy gravity and execute breathtaking feats when the new Shanghai Circus brings the ancient Chinese art of acrobatics to RVCC Arts. Friday, March 4 at 7 p.m. Then Sunday, March 13 at 3 p.m., San Jose Taiko blends the traditional patterns of Taiko with the beat of world rhythms, including African, Brazilian, Latin, and jazz, in a performance that the San Francisco Chronicle calls a superb blood racing exhibition of taiko drumming. Finally, the mystical arts of Tibet, featuring the famed multiphonic singers of the Dripung Lhasling Monastery, take the stage with sacred music, sacred dance. Saturday, April 23rd at 8 p.m. Welcome the world to your backyard at RVCC Arts in Branchburg. For more on these and a season full of great performances, visit them online at rvccarts.org. That's rvccarts.org. This is the show where Jersey matters. From politics to entertainment, from social issues to lifestyles, from newsmakers to pop culture. If it's Jersey, it's on Jersey Central with Burt Barron. Well, he's very popular. Sportos, motorheads, geeks, bloods, wastoids, dweebies, they all adore him. They think he's a righteous dude. On the new Talk Radio 1450 WCTC, the voice of Central Jersey. All right, it is 751 on Jersey Central on the new Talk Radio WCTC, the voice of Central Jersey. Performer Vivi Noir is here, and we're getting excited for her uh, one-year anniversary show, which is going to be happening this Thursday in Donellan at Roxy and Duke's uh, Roadhouse. It is an 830 show. Uh, tickets are on sale now at roxyanddukes.com. But uh, let's give away a couple pairs of tickets and let somebody come see you. How's that? That sounds great. All right, 732-545-9282 or 888-545-9282. We'll take first two callers. Callers one and two will each win a pair of tickets uh, to the show on Thursday night at 830 in Donnellan, and you'll have a chance to see a great night of entertainment. Maybe it's something you're familiar with or 
Maybe you're a first timer. There's a lot of first timers, VV, that come out and see you, right? Oh, there are a ton of first timers. Sure. We love first timers. And then they're hooked. Once they see it, they come back every time. Right? And they so bring friends. That's even better. <laughs> exactly. So first two callers right now, 732 545 9282 or 888 545 9282 will each win a pair of tickets to the one year anniversary show of the Noir Follies at, uh, in Dunellen at the uh, Roxy and Dukes Roadhouse. So call now. First two callers are going to win. Now, you also do uh, classes. If someone wants to learn from you how you do what you do, you offer classes, right? You have a, a studio where you do classes? I do. I teach um, burlesque fitness. I also teach private lessons. If you are looking to build a burlesque on a burlesque act on your own, uh, my studio is South Jersey Dance Theater okay. in Shrewsbury, New Jersey. And, again, we teach everything from steady fitness classes to uh, workshops. We just recently had a, a request for one of our workshops. It was a twerk shop. <laughs> oh, the, the old the Miley Cyrus thing. Yep. Twerk shop. I like that. Twerk right. shop and floor work. <laughs> right, so right. taught you how to bump and grind like a Interesting. pro. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Okay. And uh, in addition to these, uh, this appearance, you have uh, you're going to be at uh, in Asbury Park very soon. Very exciting. What's going on there? I will be in May. I am. Doing burlesque for the Beard and Stash Alliance, their competition they that have every a, year. That's a huge get together, oh, and I, I yes. love seeing the facial hair styles that uh, that oh, people the, show off at those events. Right? They're amazing. They're absolutely amazing. But what is really great about that show is the profits are all. I believe it's the profits go to a uh, non local non kill animal shelter. What a nice thing to do. It's what a wonderful absolutely. thing to do. Absolutely. So a lot of it is time donation. Wow. I know I personally donate my time to As do I. It's a great cause. Help. Yes. Helping oh. out animals, of course. You gotta love the furry creatures. Now you said this industry, the burlesque uh, the family, the burlesque troops, they do a lot of charity where they do a, they raise a lot of money for different causes, right? And yours is no different. We do. Um every July show, our fourth of July show, is a donation show to a wounded veteran um nice. last year we did a, a private donation to a a friend of one of our performers who was wounded i believe it was in afghanistan mm. and everything is done just independently through us it is a gift from us to that individual and we try and do as much as we can um there are tons and tons and tons of breast cancer awareness shows uh a lot of shows where individuals are having a health issue, we will do a private show and raise money to help them. Um, it, it's a very, very charitable community of of performers because we all know that we need a little bit of help sometimes. Uh, everybody everybody <laughs> in this world needs some help now and then, so that's, that's a wonderful thing to do. Uh, what if someone wants to contact you about maybe booking a, a show at their place or finding out more information about you? How does someone contact you? Well, if you were interested in booking myself or the Follies or another performer, we do do private parties, private events. Um, we, You can contact us via Facebook. Uh, you can also contact through email. My email is miss.vv.noir at gmail.com. Just send me your information, what you're looking for, your contact info, and just a general idea. And I can help you as much as I can, or I can refer you to somebody who I feel would fit what you need <laughs> very good okay all right excellent well congratulations and you're keeping this art form alive in, in jersey and you're doing a nice job of it yeah and that's a very important you. thing to us bringing it to new jersey yeah uh, there's a huge 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 community in new york huge community in philly and people tend to go to those two areas but there's tons of shows in new jersey and for a lot of us we don't have to take the two-hour commute to those areas just right Look into your own backyard. You're filling that void here in Jersey, so good I for you. I am trying my hardest. <laughs> Keep up the great work, all right? Thank you. Good stuff, and thank you for being here, and uh, good luck with the show on Thursday, all thank right? Thank you very much. All right, my pleasure. All right, Jersey Central traffic and weather time, 7.55. Traffic and weather every 10 minutes on the fives. Congratulations to Jerry in Milltown and Mike in Edison, who are both going to be going to the burlesque show. The one-year anniversary of the Noir Follies uh, coming up this Thursday in uh, Dinellan. Congratulations to them. Let's get the update on the traffic now. Here's Bernie. Hey, Bert, uh, along Route 1 northbound Woodbridge after Plainfield Avenue, it is especially slow. If you're traveling southbound, you're going to be slow by Old Post Road and into the county line. 287 now pretty heavy from exit 2 to 4, then between exits 9.